The state won't start seeing tax revenue from recreational marijuana sales for at least another year, but House Speaker Robert DeLeo already knows what he wants to see that revenue spent on. Tony D. News reporter Tamara Sakarzik is live to break down how his suggestion could help fight the state's opioid epidemic. Well, Kate and Rich, as you already know, state leaders still haven't hammered out all of the regulations for recreational marijuana. Dispensaries are expected to open next year, but we still haven't been told what the tax revenue from those sales would be used for. House Speaker Robert DeLeo announced Tuesday that he has a suggestion. He wants the state to spend the money on opiate addiction. DeLeo said the tax revenue from pot sales should be directed to a substance abuse addiction fund. The speaker compared it to a trust fund that the state created to prevent problems problem gambling. The trust fund uses the revenue from casinos in Massachusetts to prevent and treat gambling addiction. Governor Charlie Baker said he hasn't discussed the proposed fund with DeLeo yet, but did call the idea interesting. Now, opioid addiction is still a major problem here in Massachusetts. According to the Department of Health, there were 2,000 opioid-related overdose deaths last year, making it the sixth consecutive year where there was an increase in overdoses. If the state decides to use marijuana revenue to try and curb addiction, it would still be at least a year away. Retail pot sales aren't expected to begin until 2018. Tamara Sakarzik, 22 News.